Thanks. Sorry, only the man over there won't stop talking. I just wanted to read this in peace. I couldn't concentrate. He just kept going on about his collections or something. I normally wouldn't mind too much. Only when you get a letter like this, you need to use all your concentration. You can't have someone talking in your ear, especially when you're trying to decipher writing like this. <laughs> he must have been stoned out of his mind when he wrote it. It wouldn't be unusual. Look at it. He wants me to come back. Some hopes. To him. He's sorry. He didn't mean to do what he did. He won't do it again. I promise, etc, etc. I seem to have heard that one before. And it's not the first time, I can tell you. And there's no excuse for it, is there? Violence. I mean, what am I meant to do? Go back to that every single time he... There's no excuse. A fracture, you know? A compound fracture. That's what they told me. I mean, it's right there. You can practically still see it to this day. Two x-rays. I said to him when I got home, I said, you bastard. You know what you did to my head? And he just stands there, you know, the way he does and says, I'm sorry. I'm ever so sorry. I said to him, you bastard, you bad tempered, uncontrolled, violent bastard. And you know what he said? He said, call me a bastard one more time and I'll smash your stupid face in.